John D. Rockefeller's early ventures in the mid-19th century laid the groundwork for his future prominence. At just 16, he delved into the nascent oil industry, recognizing its potential. His initial role as a bookkeeper allowed him to grasp the industry's intricacies, and by 1863, Rockefeller ventured into partnership, establishing a refinery. His strategic approach, emphasizing efficiency and cost reduction, saw immense success. Through innovative practices like vertical integration and consolidating numerous oil companies into Standard Oil, Rockefeller forged a monopoly. This era marked a time of transformation in the oil industry, with Rockefeller leading the charge. His keen business sense, coupled with relentless drive and astute decisions, propelled him toward unparalleled success, becoming a name synonymous with both wealth and controversy in the business world. John D. Rockefeller's innovative approach reshaped the oil industry in unparalleled ways. His pioneering strategies laid the groundwork for modern corporate practices. The hallmark of his success was horizontal integration, where his company, Standard Oil, acquired numerous competitors. This strategy consolidated the industry under one entity, optimizing efficiency, reducing duplication, and dramatically cutting costs. Equally impactful was his emphasis on vertical integration. By controlling every phase of the oil production process, from extraction to distribution, Rockefeller ensured tighter oversight, superior quality control, and remarkable economies of scale. This vertical integration streamlined operations, increased productivity, and led to substantial cost savings. His commitment to refining processes was groundbreaking. Rockefeller invested significantly in refining technologies, pioneering new techniques that elevated the quality of refined oil products. Additionally, his introduction of the first oil pipeline transformed transportation. This innovation vastly improved the efficiency of moving oil over long distances, slashing costs and expanding market access. Rockefeller's strategic use of railroads further revolutionized the industry. Through savvy negotiations and efficient operations, he optimized oil transportation, making it more affordable and accessible to broader markets. Beyond just transforming the oil industry, Rockefeller's innovative tactics became benchmarks for corporate management. His approaches to consolidation, vertical integration, and transportation not only shaped the oil sector, but also set precedents for modern business practices, leaving an enduring legacy in the realms of industry and commerce. John D. Rockefeller's ascent to dominance in the oil industry wasn't without controversy. His company, Standard Oil, achieved an unprecedented level of control, becoming synonymous with monopoly power. Through strategic acquisitions and rigorous tactics, Standard Oil eventually controlled over 90% of oil production in the United States. This rapid expansion raised concerns about the abuse of market power. Critics argued that Rockefeller's practices stifled competition, hampering smaller businesses and limiting consumer choices. Standard Oil's dominance in refining, transportation and distribution allowed them to dictate prices and influence market dynamics. This immense control triggered antitrust concerns and led to public outcry. The culmination of such concerns led to legal action. In 1911, the U.S. Supreme Court ruled to dismantle Standard Oil, deeming it an illegal monopoly under the Sherman Antitrust Act. The breakup of the company into smaller entities aimed to restore competition and prevent such concentrated power from hindering fair market practices. Despite the subsequent dissolution of Standard Oil, Rockefeller's legacy in monopolistic practices reshaped the regulatory landscape. His dominance highlighted the need for antitrust legislation to prevent excessive control in industries, influencing future regulations to curb monopolistic tendencies and promote fair competition. While his methods sparked controversies, they also triggered reforms that shaped modern antitrust laws and policies. John D. Rockefeller's legacy extends beyond business to philanthropy, marking an indelible impact on society. After amassing vast wealth, he dedicated himself to philanthropic endeavors, setting a precedent for giving back. His philanthropy focused on various causes, including education, public health, 
and scientific research. Through the Rockefeller Foundation, established in 1913, he aimed to improve human welfare globally. The foundation contributed significantly to medical research, facilitating the development of drugs for diseases like malaria and yellow fever. It also supported educational initiatives, enhancing educational opportunities and institutions worldwide. Rockefeller's philanthropy wasn't limited to his foundation. He contributed to countless educational institutions, aiding in their growth and development. His donations funded the founding of the University of Chicago and supported historically black colleges and universities. His impact reverberates through the enduring institutions and initiatives he helped establish. The Rockefeller Foundation's contributions to global health and education continue to save lives and empower communities. Beyond the financial support, his philanthropy set a precedent for future magnates, encouraging them to use their wealth for societal betterment. Rockefeller's philanthropic philosophy focused on fostering systemic change rather than mere charity. He believed in addressing root causes to create sustainable, long-term solutions for societal issues. His commitment to philanthropy left an enduring legacy, inspiring generations of philanthropists to follow suit and make meaningful contributions to society. His success in the oil industry was accompanied by controversies surrounding antitrust laws. His company, Standard Oil, gained immense control over the oil refining market, raising concerns about monopolistic practices. The company's dominance triggered debates and legal actions, eventually leading to the famous antitrust case in 1911. The Supreme Court ruled to break up Standard Oil into smaller, independent companies to curb its monopolistic influence. Rockefeller's business tactics, including aggressive acquisitions and establishing control across various facets of the oil industry, raised questions about fair competition. Critics argued that Standard Oil's practices stifled competition, limiting opportunities for smaller businesses and hindering market dynamics. However, Rockefeller's supporters highlighted his efficiency in streamlining operations, enhancing productivity, and reducing oil prices. They contended that Standard Oil's success was a result of innovative practices and economies of scale, benefiting consumers with lower costs. The antitrust case against Standard Oil set a precedent, marking a pivotal moment in American business history. It highlighted the government's commitment to preserving fair competition and preventing monopolistic control in industries, even among influential entities. Though the breakup of Standard Oil marked the end of Rockefeller's control over the oil industry, it didn't diminish his legacy. His innovative practices and controversial business strategies sparked conversations that shaped modern antitrust laws, aiming to maintain fair and competitive market landscapes. John D. Rockefeller's legacy extends far beyond the oil industry, encompassing his influence on philanthropy, business practices, and societal impact. His groundbreaking strategies in the oil industry revolutionized business operations, but his commitment to philanthropy defined a lasting legacy. Rockefeller's philanthropic efforts were unparalleled. Following the dissolution of Standard Oil, he devoted himself to charitable endeavors, focusing on education, medicine, and scientific research. His philanthropic vehicle, the Rockefeller Foundation, became a pioneering force in public health initiatives, supporting medical advancements and eradicating diseases like hookworm and yellow fever. The impact of his philanthropy reverberates to this day, influencing numerous institutions that continue to contribute significantly to society. Furthermore, Rockefeller's legacy is intertwined with the evolution of antitrust laws in the United States. His dominance in the oil industry prompted regulatory reforms to prevent monopolistic practices, shaping modern business regulations. While his business practices faced scrutiny, Rockefeller's philanthropic legacy endures as a testament to his vision for societal progress. He set a benchmark for philanthropy, emphasizing strategic giving, scientific innovation, and societal advancement, inspiring future generations of philanthropists and reshaping the landscape of charitable endeavors. Overall, John D. Rockefeller's legacy is a complex amalgamation of business innovation, controversies, philanthropic largesse, 
and an enduring impact on societal welfare that continues to shape the world today.